Hi, I'm Ilkay Bora and welcome to my tutorial series Lightning Sibelius. Today I'm going to show you how to assign custom shortcuts to X and Y offset and how to rise your fine adjustment speed immensely. Unfortunately, we cannot add shortcuts to X and Y offsets in Sibelius by default. So when you need to do some fine adjustments, you should continue to open the inspector by running its shortcut. And to bring your mouse pointer there, do your settings and return to the bar and repeat this process with other nodes. Now, this is okay if you need to do one or two little adjustments, but what if you need to work with such page when you need to repeat this task continuously? Yes, I thought the same. It's time losing and here comes how to assign shortcuts to these values. The very first thing you need to do is to download the copy plugin and XY offset plugin, which both were written by the plugin master Bob Zawalich. So kudos to him. To download these plugins, go to file, plugins, install plugins, come to the show tab and click on all plugins, write copy plugin to the search bar, find it from the list and click on install button. Repeat the same process for XY offset plugin, find it from the list and click on install button. After downloading these plugins, run copy plugin by writing its name to the common search. Find XY offset plugin from the list and write X write to the second and third slots. Then click on copy plugin. Now we need to repeat this process for X left plugin. So do the same thing. Find XY offset plugin from the list and this time write X left and click on copy plugin button. I presume that you have already done these settings and now we can assign shortcuts to these newly copied plugins. Go to file, preferences, keyboard shortcuts, come to the plugin tab and go to the bottom of the menu and you will find your newly copied X left and X right plugins. Click on add button and I'm going to use Ctrl Shift F5 for my X left plugin and Ctrl Shift F6 for my X right plugin. And I click OK. Now run the X right plugin by hitting its shortcut. Write 0 0.06 to the X value and choose Hide Dialog unless no selection option. Click on Cancel Set button. Let's repeat this process for X left plugin. Run it by hitting its shortcut, but this time write minus 0.06 for the X left value. Choose Hide Dialog unless no selection option and click on Cancel Set button. OK, let's see them in the action. As you see, now I'm able to do little adjustments by using only my keyboard shortcuts and as you can imagine, it is way faster to do these settings in this way instead of doing them via the inspector. Thank you for watching the video. If you liked it, please subscribe to my channel and click on the thumbs up button below. See you soon in another Lightning Sibelius chapter.